Tomorrow I'm leaving to go on a vacation with my family and anytime I go somewhere new, gotta do a little fishing. So I'm at Bass Pro Shops and I need to pick up some saltwater surf gear to catch uh, whatever species are in the place I'm going. So I'm heading to a section where I really don't spend any time at all at BPS, the saltwater section. But uh, fortunately, my buddy Cornell recommended me a couple baits, so we're gonna try them out. I need to pick up some Berkeley Gulp, you know, freshwater scent doesn't really play that much of a role, but I heard in saltwater scent is extremely important, and I'm pretty confident that Gulp works. I mean, it says right there, catch more fish. So let's go ahead and get this natural color right here, and we'll get this uh, molting color. Who wouldn't want to eat a molting shrimp? That's like eating a soft crawfish. Got the shrimp imitation, now I'm gonna go with the fish imitation. Swimming mullet, and we're gonna go ahead and try the five inch swimming mullet, and since the water's gonna be super clear, I'm gonna pick a natural white pattern. I got the plastics, now I need to find some jig heads to match with him. Bucktails, no, we need the plain jig heads. Uh, a lot of options here. Oh, what do we got here? Eighth ounce shrimp body jig head in white. And for the bigger baits, let's go with quarter ounce shad jig heads. Should do just fine. All right, last thing I need is one more travel spinning rod. I only have one, so I want to make sure I have a backup because I've had some bad luck breaking travel rods when I'm on trips. Got the goods. Now it's time to hit the beach. I made it in the Bahamas at the resort. Got my fishing rod. My dad's out here. And uh, we actually already caught a fish. Fish on. Oh, sh Oh, we got fish, fish. Come here, come here, come here. Oh, oh. Oh, I got him! I got him! Barracuda! Oh, what is this? I got one! I actually got something! Oh crap! It's right here! Oh, it's coming back! Coming back! Coming back! Got him! Got him! Get him! Get him! Get him! Get him! Get him! I got him! What is that? What is that? Oh crap! Go away! Oh crap! No! No! Oh, get him again! Wait, hold on! Get your baited! Throw your baited! He's still here! He's still here! He's so dumb! I got him! He's such a dumb fish! No! 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 Go! Go! Okay, get back in there. Oh my God, I can't First cast. I got him. Oh, sh oh he's going back. He's going back. Got him. No. Get back in there. Dude, this fish is so dumb. Stupid. Oh no. He's still going. We got to land this fish. Oh, he's right there. He's right there. Oh, I see him. I see him. He's in the waves. Here we go. Got him. Fish on. I got him. This guy. Is, it, is that the same one? Ah! We got him this time, baby. What is that thing? Woo! First fish of the day. We are out here in the Bahamas, out here with my dad. This is fish number one. Oh, look at those teeth. Look at that thing. Look at those teeth. Uh, not too close. <laughs> what is this? Is this a barracuda? I don't know. That thing is feisty. This might be the dumbest fish I've ever seen. I literally hooked it 20,000 times. This is one badass looking fish, guys. I right, just let him go. Go be free. That was a uh, pretty interesting start to the morning. I already got one fish. <laughs> Feels good because as you guys know, I suck at saltwater fishing. What I'm using is a uh, quarter ounce jig head. Then I'm pairing that up with uh, a five inch Berkeley Gulp swimming mullet. Pretty universal uh, rig, I think, to catch a variety of species, I hope. Got one already. Uh, let's see what else we got around here. The fishing slowed down. We just got that one fish so far. Making a move over here. There's a lot of seagulls and you got the jetty wall. I'm thinking there's got to be something good around that area. Oh, there's one. Oh, fish on. Oh, they hit it. I got him. First cast by the rocks. Oh, he got off. He got Oh, yeah, I got him. I got him. I got him. Did I got him? Or is he off? I think I got him. I got him. He's on. He's on. He's on. First cast by the rocks. Let's see what I got. Oh, a new species. What is this? I got a little jack. Uh, this is actually something I know what it is, That's I think. Jack? No, no, I think it's a Jack Creval. I think. Don't quote me on that. Alright, still got him in that mullet. Let's see how go. He's croaking. 
I think it's a Jack Raval. You guys can let me know if I'm right or wrong on that. You see that? Cast right there, the giant barracuda. Holy crap. Gonna head on top of these rocks now, get out a little bit further, and uh, we might be able to see some fish. Uh. Oh yeah, it's a nice angle up here. Oh, this fish. Oh, it's a good fish. Good fish. All right, little fish, little fish. Oh, this will be interesting landing. Oh, it's a jack. Oh, what is that? Oh, I got something new, Dad. Ah! Look at this. I don't know. Another new species, though. Interesting looking fish. Fishing a seven pound fluorocarbon around rocks. Gotta live dangerously sometimes. Oh, it's teeth. I was about to put my finger in his mouth. That's a couple teeth. All right, another fish, guys. You got to help me out on the uh, identification. But let me go ahead and try to let it go safely. Oh, it's a big fish! Oh, it's a giant! Oh, no! No! Holy oh, crap! It's a giant fish. It came right out of the rocks. It's a big grouper. It's a grouper. Holy crap. All right. It's a grouper. Yeah, it's a grouper. I saw It's a grouper. Jesus! All right, guys, I'm getting hyped. Getting hyped right here is a giant grouper right there came out of the rocks. Man, I don't know if you guys saw the last strike, but that fish came out from under the freaking rock, slammed my bait. Not really sure how I missed it, but fishing this ultra clear 30 foot plus visibility water. It's freaking awesome. Oh sh dude. <laughs> that was lucky. Uh, no, no, I have a lens cap on it. Oh, there's one fish shot. No! Damn it! Fish right here. There's a fish. Got one. Uh, I got him. Little guy. What do we got here? Alright, oh! A, uh, I'm gonna guess this is a red snapper. That's my guess for this fish. It's red, and I caught him on the rocks. Kind of looks like a snapper. So that's, we'll, that's what we'll go with. All right, see you, buddy. A lot of fish by these rocks right here. I switched my bait up to this uh, Berkeley. I think it's a Ripple Shadow, something like that. A little bit more of a compact profile. I also increased my leader to 12 pounds for a little more abrasion resistance. I'm trying to go as light as possible because this water is the clearest water I've ever seen in my life. There's one. Better fish. Better fish right here. Oh yeah, it's a good fish. Oh my gosh, it's pulling drag. Alright, best fish of the day. Oh, what is that? It's a school. Oh, okay, okay. I think it's a school of jacks. There's like 10 fish in the water. Nice. I don't know what it is, but it's cool. What do we got here? Alright, 12 pound line, don't touch your rocks. Alright, we're gonna have to get him up. Alright, we got a good sized jack right here. Man, this is why fishing the ocean is so much freaking fun. You never know what you're gonna catch. Where's the blue runner? Ah, no! Oh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I was gonna go for a good release and walk him down there. Sorry, buddy. My bad. There's got another one. It must be another jack. Oh, it's pulling. Holy. Man, so much fish is so much fun to fight. What do we got here? I think it's another jack. Gosh, it's fighting hard. Oh, it's something different, I think. God. 10 pound braid, 12 pound fluorocarbon all day. Oh, same fish, same species. Oh wait, is it, it might be different. I know, same, same. Or different. No, it might be different. Get him up. Oh, come here, come here. That's a big fish. Oh, no, no, not the rocks. No, no, no. All right, we got to land this guy. This is too dangerous. 
This is extremely dangerous fishing right here. No, no. Ow, my nuts. All right, come here, buddy. Come here. I'm going to let you go. Ah! I'm thinking, no, this is a different fish. Ah, calm down. It's definitely a different fish. All right, I don't think this team. I'm putting my hand in his mouth. Here we go. Got him. All right, we're safe. Oh, there we go. That is the only way I want to hold a fish ever, is in the, on the lip. Beautiful fish right here. Don't have no idea what it is. All right, we need a good release this time. I got to make up for that last one. Here we go down here. Ah, oh, yeah, here we go. Nice little release for you, buddy. Whoa, here you go. If you ever get the opportunity to fish the surf, definitely cover a portion of the beach, but anytime you see a jetty or rock formations, anything like that that's different in the water, those fish are gonna be schooled up around there. The fishing is likely to be awesome like it is today. Gonna to take a little break from these rocks. My dad's losing too much gear and he's having some trouble on these uh, rough surfaces. So we're gonna fish the beach some more and uh, I'll definitely be back here pretty soon though. Making our way to the rocks. Goal for today is get my dad on one fish. Have you caught a fish yet this year? To be honest with you, the last time I caught a fish, we were at Rehoboth Beach. Oh, last year we were fishing. And that was the first time I ever caught a fish on an artificial bait. Oh yeah, so this will be number two. Yeah, I All remember right. that fish was about three inches long. <laughs> well, this will be a good fish if you get one now. What the What are you doing? You all right? <laughs> All right, this is going to be challenging, guys. We're only about a quarter of the way there. We need to get all the way to the end. Huh? Oh, can't fish it? Okay, no, okay, we'll leave. Sorry about that. All right. Well, we got to leave off the jetty. Unfortunately, you didn't manage to catch a fish today, well, but let me uh, tell you right now, we're not leaving off the jetty, okay? <laughs> that guy's not part of the Bahamian National Department of uh, Fisheries. <laughs> he's a jet, he's a wave runner, a rental guy, okay? All right, we're saying that. You just wait for him to come back out. Gotcha. No luck. Well, and it's only morning one. We got uh, we got all week to get out here, catch some more fish. Definitely some interesting species to get out. We'll uh, get back out here again, right, Dad? Well, all I can say is um. I struck out. It reminds me when I was in, uh, in grade school, um, 45, 50 years ago, all they had was Little League Baseball, and there was no designated hitters back then. The coach used to have me bat ninth and play right field. Um, a lot of people know that that means that you're not too athletically inclined, but what my coach did to fool me, when I always asked him why did I bat last, he said, well, I have you batting ninth because I'm saving the best for last. All right, guys, he just told like a three-minute story, which I probably cut out, but... Good fishing, Dad. We'll get back out here and get you on a fish next time.